Okay. Kills not to be with Allison. Kills to know that, that she's hurting. And I would do anything to be with her. Anything to make her feel better. Anything. No, no. Almost anything. Almost anything. That, that, that's your soul, Rafe. You can't give him that. But Allison is my soul. <clears throat> my wife. <laughs> God, I love the sound of that. So do I. I wish this could go on forever. I didn't mean that Rebecca talks to you. No, no, it's exactly what you meant, and it's the second time that you said it. Allison, you, you think that she talks back to you. You wouldn't understand, Jamal. It's just... Hey, try me. Come on. I can't. Allison, look, we were... We were together for a long time. Okay, I loved you more than anything in the world. I still love you. And I know there's a part of you that still cares for me, too. Okay, so... Come on. Look at it from my point of view. All right, if I was in a barn making candles, talking to a picture, and hearing her talk back to me. Come on, what would you do? Jamal, sometimes you just need to trust people and trust what is in your heart. Well, my heart is telling me is that you're in trouble right now. You're pushing away everybody that cares about you and you're cutting yourself off from the real world. I'm yes. not hurting yes, anyone. Yes, you are. You're hurting yourself, Allie. Rafe is gone and he's not coming back. Losing yourself in some fantasy world is not going to change that. That's not what I'm doing. That's exactly what you're doing, Allison. Look, why don't you just get rid of all this stuff? All right, just, just give it up, okay? Starting with that picture over there. Jamal, there was once a time when you would have just believed in me. I don't, I don't, I don't know what to do. Maybe if you can't believe in me, then maybe there's nothing for you to do except leave. You can't live like this. What are you going to do? Are you going to kidnap me again? I know that you, you think that me closing down the shop was wrong, but, but what if what we're doing isn't right? What if it would be better for us and for everyone else if we just stopped? Would it just be better if, if we got rid of everything? Do you really want to get rid of everything, Allison? Do you really want to get rid of me? I thought that you were never going to talk to me ever again. I didn't think you wanted to hear what I had to say. You once told me that the world in this century was different from when I lived. That the people, your people, were more open, more accepting. If you destroy all this, if you destroy me, and all you'll have proved is that the world hasn't changed at all. Olivia, I missed you so much. Oh, Chuck, I missed you too. And now that I know you're on my side, we can make this right together. Yeah. For everyone. And I want to help Allison too. Yes, and the best way to do that is to stop all this. Hey, what are... Allison's candles doing here? Oh, my dad's sending them. 
off to the lab to have them checked in. I'm sure he'll find the proof we need to end all this. Yeah. You know, I just, I just can't imagine Allison putting something dangerous in these kids. You know, I was thinking that maybe uh. I could take your, we could take your advice and forget about the candles for at least one night. And, oh, yeah, 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 and concentrate on each other. How's that sound? Oh, that sounds good to me. Yeah? I like that. All right, well, I'm going to pack, and I'll be gone Mwah, for two seconds. Okay. Two. Two. I'll be right back. Probably the one Lucy had. Here we go. Oh, uh, what the heck? It can't be too harmful. Let's try this baby out. All right. Let me feel the warmth. Ah. <laughs> that does make you feel kind of warm. to be with Allison again. I'm so worried about what's going to happen to her. Please. Please just give me the strength. Please give me the strength. But Rebecca, the world has changed and things are different. My friends, they're not, they're not trying to hurt me. They're just really worried about me. And I think that maybe they're right. I mean, what if I am using you and these candles to make up for what I feel in my heart, the loss of Rafe? <sighs> and what's wrong with that? Do you really believe that you should let go of people you love as your friends are asking you to? Oh, Allison. Because I believe that you should take joy in the love that you had and let it continue to enrich your life. You learned to open your heart more than you ever believed possible with Rafe. You always had that gift, but he made you realize it. And now you can do that for other people. I, I want to do the right thing. I just, I don't know, I don't know what to do. I'm just I'm so confused. It's because you're doubting yourself, listening to what everyone else tells you, believing everything except that which you feel. I heard you defend me. I heard you defending what we're trying to do here for other people. Why can't you hear yourself anymore? I want to bring love alive in my heart again, and I, I want to bring it to others. It's just that it's a blessing and a burden, I know. People fight it. You fight it. Because love is work. It can be so painful. But now you're doubting yourself and listening to other people. And now your blessing has become a burden. And so you're letting it go. Where are you going? I'm saying goodbye, my sweet. No longer believing means no longer believing in me. We won't be speaking anymore. What will happen to you? Where will you go? I'll go back to where I came from. And I'll hope that someday people will know what my life was all about. And I'll finally be able to rest in peace. But I, I just... I, I want to do the right thing. I do. I just... I don't know what that is, and I don't know if what we're doing is the right way to do it. What does your heart tell you? It tells me that what we're doing is good. That the, the 
we don't need to stop this. Then stand your ground and fight the fight that I couldn't. Okay. I can. I, I'll do that. I will. I'll, I'll do that, Rebecca. Just, just stay, okay? Just stay. I, I, I won't. I won't disappoint you. I promise. I won't. Oh, my God. 